Russia by far is the world's biggest nation, has roughly twice the land area of Canada, the world's second largest, and encompasses all of northern Asia and the eastern part of Europe. This vast land has been the site of several astonishing discoveries that will blow your mind. Today's video will be fascinating since we'll go through some of the most intriguing findings from the 18,000-year-old frozen wolf dog, human-sized stones, to a genius Russian kid from Mars. So stay tuned. Dogor is an 18,000-year-old dog discovered in Siberian permafrost whose name means friend in Yakut. The bones of the archaic pup are perplexing. Experts since genetic testing suggest it's neither a wolf nor a dog, suggesting it might be an elusive progenitor or both. According to the Northeastern Federal University in Yakutsk, the bones were discovered in a frozen lump of earth near the Indigucha River in the summer of 2018. The animal's head, nose, whiskers, eyelashes, and mouth are well preserved, indicating that it still had milk teeth when it died. According to researchers, the animal was only two months old when it died, but they are yet to know what caused its demise. The pup is so well preserved that researchers from Sweden's Center for Paleogenetics were able to sequence its DNA using a fragment of rib bone. The findings revealed that Dogar was male, but the experts couldn't tell whether he was a dog or a wolf even after two rounds of examinations. It's typically very straightforward to detect the difference between both, David Stanton, a Center for Paleogenetics Research Fellow, tells CNN's Amy Woodyatt. We already have a lot of data from it, and with that quantity of data, you'd expect to determine whether it was one or the other. We can't suggest that it's from a population ancestral to dogs and wolves. The discovery is intriguing regardless of whether Dogor is a common canine progenitor, an early dog, or an early wolf. According to Hannah Knowles of the Washington Post, Dogor originates from a fascinating period in canine history when wolf species were going out and early dogs were starting to appear. Scientists also differ on how canines were partnered with humans. Some believe people grabbed wolf pups and purposely domesticated them. Others believe that a strain of friendly, less aggressive wolves tamed itself by hanging out near people and accessing their leftover food. Dogor's DNA might assist in solving these riddles. According to Daria Litanova and Roman Kutuko of the Associated Press, the team wants to conduct a third round of DNA testing that will assist in conclusively positioning Dogor in the canine family tree. It's also likely that researchers could soon get access to additional samples. Mysterious Bronze Age Burial Archaeologists discovered the Bronze Age bones of a couple near Lake Baikal in 2016. It was clear from in a way that these two were not your typical pair. The two skeletons were discovered holding hands with decorations and other artifacts around them. Archaeologists described the two as a young couple from the Bronze Age Glaswegian Society. However, they later discovered that the bones belonged to an older man and a younger lady. Their relationship is still unknown. However, how they were buried shows that they had a strong bond. A rare white jade ring was found above one of the man's eye sockets, and three others were discovered on his breast. Red deer pendants and decorations made of musk deer teeth all around his skeleton. They found just a vast jade knife on the lady. The most puzzling artifact discovered amid the bones was a little leather pouch between the man's kneecaps. The actual location of the grave is still kept secret to prevent damaged diggers from wrecking the place. Surprisingly, archaeologists refuse to reveal what they discovered inside the leather bag. Interesting, isn't it? Alien corpse found in nuclear power plant. Several employees were shocked when they discovered a peculiar shriveled body near a nuclear power facility in Russia. The carcass was already in advanced stages of decay, making it very difficult for researchers and experts to identify the bizarre species. The strange discovery piqued the interest of UFO hunters who eagerly asserted that the mystery body belonged to an alien entity. The carcass confounded experts from the Institute of Biophysics and none could identify the odd beast. They believed the skull was neither fish nor fowl and lacked a neck and wings. People were more convinced that the body belonged to an alien entity. However, there are several elements to consider. The weird corpse might be an animal that died in an accident, leaving its body unusual and disfigured. There's also a potential that the animals mutated as a result of living near the power plant. Although this option has severe ramifications for the plant's functioning, and there's a strong likelihood that this body is a mutant chicken embryo rather than a dead extraterrestrial, many still feel that this is the first proof of alien life on our planet. If this is a strange creature's corpse, what was it doing near a nuclear power plant in the first place? This is still an open question. Ice Age Architecture a gigantic structure created from the bones of 60 mammoths is one of the archaeological finds of the 21st century that has proven to be one of the most puzzling. A woodland steppe in Russia is where this incredible find was unearthed, and it will blow your mind. 
So is the case with most old buildings. People have yet to learn how this mammoth bone construction was formed. The most important question, however, is why people who lived in incredibly turbulent times 25,000 years ago bothered to create this tower in the first place. What was the point of constructing this tower if they were ready to invest so much time, effort, and money into it? The whole structure had a vast circumference of 40 feet, and it was obvious that a great deal of effort and time had been put into its construction. Archaeologists uncovered several hints that helped them better understand its function. Inside the building, amid the pits, were traces of fire and food remnants. This ancient structure might have been constructed during the Ice Age to store food or perform rituals. Today, a significant number of people think that this magnificent monument was built more for secular reasons than for religious ones. Stone Spheres of Champ Island Certain phenomena witnessed during a polar trip cannot be explained, but certain things on Champ Island in Russia's Franz Josef Land fit the label of mystery. Champ Island is one of the numerous polar islands that make up the desolate archipelago known as Franz Josef Land. The fact that it's covered with spherical stones of varied sizes distinguishes it from roughly 200 partner islands in the Arctic Ocean. The dimensions of these stone balls vary. Some are the size of ping pong balls, some are human size, while others are much bigger, up to 3 meters in diameter. Because the island is deserted, no one knows how these stones got there. No people or human documents explain what caused the rocks to appear the way they did. A possible explanation is that these stone balls are concretions, mineral masses created when a cementing sedimentary material transported by water comes into touch with an organic nucleus such as a leaf, twig, shell, or fossil. The subsequent chemical process builds the balls in layers, frequently as perfect spheres. These balls are found throughout the globe, and individuals have been known to split them open to find a fossil within. Alien Skeleton with an Elongated Skull the finding of these skulls in Russia sparked ideas of extraterrestrial cover-ups. It was not only an ordinary archaeological discovery. In the year 2021, the skeletal remains of five persons were also found in the part of Crimea that Russia had occupied. Each of the five skulls were extended and didn't have the typical form of a human head, which was unusual. According to carbon dating, the skulls are at least 2,000 years old, and the individuals who formerly had them were members of the ancient Sarmatian civilization. The extended heads led to the burial site being referred to as an extraterrestrial tomb. However, researchers believe that there is a far simpler explanation for the peculiar skull, and that explanation is deliberate skull elongation. The Sarmatian civilization had a tradition of modifying the skulls, and they thought elongated skulls were lovely. In addition, it was a necessary trait for soldiers of any gender, even women. A very long time ago, the inhabitants of this civilization used to push their bones together by tying wooden boards to their heads. It was progressively changing their skull anatomy as they got older. For them, lengthening the skull included more than simply a change in appearance on the outside. It was a sign that a fierce and fearless warrior was coming. Aphrodite Cult Archaeologists uncovered a priestess grave from 1900 years ago in the ancient cemetery of Phanagoria in Russia in 2022. They thought that the priestess belonged to a sect that worshipped Aphrodite, the Greek goddess of love, pleasure, passion, and beauty. Along with her were ancient artifacts and the skeletons of numerous warriors. Archaeologists discovered an incredible silver medallion around 2.75 inches in diameter and less than an inch thick in the tomb. Aside from Aquarius and Libra, the little jewelry featured the goddess Aphrodite's inscription and many zodiac signs. The zodiac has 12 signs, each of which correlates to a star constellation for Aries, Taurus, Gemini, Leo, Cancer, Virgo, Libra, Scorpio, Capricorn, Sagittarius, Aquarius, and Pisces. The zodiac signs have been a persistent belief from ancient times, and academics still need to understand why this sect only etched 10 characters rather than 12. A genius Russian kid from Mars a brilliant Russian boy claims to be from Mars. This Russian boy takes the term out of this world to new heights. Mariska Kripriyanovich, age 24, claimed to be from the planet Mars. Mariska, born in 1966, was a prodigy child, learned to raise his head high, read, draw, and paint by the age of one, according to his mother. Some of Mariska's teachers also said that the child's language learning abilities as a two-year-old kid astonished them. And aside from that, Mariska was very sensitive and had incredible memory abilities. He was called a genius, and many people were astounded by the youngster. The most perplexing aspect about Barisco was not his intelligence, but it was claimed to be from Mars. Even as a child, he told his friends and instructors about Mars, and many were perplexed by his vast knowledge of space. His understanding goes beyond planetary systems. Apart from unsubstantiated allegations of the youngster having a 200 IQ, 
Briska claims to know the Sphinx's secret and the destiny of humanity. According to him, the Martian species was wiped out long ago by nuclear warfare, and to save humanity from meeting the same fate, the last Martian sent him to our planet. Briska also stated that additional children from Mars, known as the Indigo Children, are living on Earth with him. He also said that Martians still exist on Mars but live underground, which is why we don't see them. Russian experts characterize him as a quiet little lad with above-average intellect, but his other assertions remain unsubstantiated. Only a few photographs of him remain, and perspectives on his narrative are divided. However, we've come to the end of this video, and if you liked the video, please give us a thumbs up, subscribe to our channel, and turn on the bell notification for more videos like this. In another video, we'll come up with other startling explorations of this massive land. So keep an eye on our channel, and have a great day.